good evening everyone welcome back with me again okay so today or this time i'm here in puta area and this is our independent day actually but unfortunately um the weather since this morning was not really good the rain kind of like on and off so not really sure what happened nowadays we cannot predict the weather even though the, the, now is our dry season but sometimes we got rain as well but anyway hopefully it will not rain again so that i can uh, show you the situations around here this is jalan bakung sari in kuta and later i will drive you to um jalan katika plaza because i have request to drive past by spice mantra and also uh, aiden hotel so let's go and see together guys anyway now it's around nine o'clock and as you can see people still having their dinner look at this this is the warung chef bagus it's nice to see a lot of guests there and i think later it will be busy also at jalan katika plaza but unfortunately around in this area by this time it's not really a lot of tourists uh, roaming around but there are some tourists they're still shopping which is good and here is the what is this i forgot the name of the restaurant but it is nice small but uh, sometimes i see uh, some tourists there many times when i drive uh, by at noon and also at evening and here on the right side this is royal regentris it was royal singasari before they have changed the name Here, some businesses are open, spa of course, they're still open. And for those of you that would like to stay here at the Seoul by Melia Kuta, the hotel is open, as you see. But I don't know, on this side, it looks quiet. Well, you don't need to worry when you stay there, when you walk out, this is what you will see traffic, a lot of shops, and easy to find food. And this is Ramayana Suite and resort been to that hotel also and here if you go to the right you will go to Jalan de Pante Kuta of course and if you go straight I don't know if the market is still open by this time but there are a lot of lights there I'm guessing the market is closed it's just uh, I mean it's nine o'clock now and that is a uh, Gabah restaurant guys quite busy so we are entering Jalan Katika Plaza and as you can see BC here on the left side is the stadium spot bar wow look at this so many people enjoying their fun enjoying the drinks which is good to see that here is the Italian restaurant but look at that so many people there enjoying their dinner where you can uh, choose whatever you like they have uh, Indonesian food Indian food seafood international of course and here on the right side this is the Matilda spot bar it's quite famous also I mean quite busy not really like full pack but it's okay and here on the left side you will see few uh, restaurants if you like to try seafood grilled seafood you can come here also anyway you have a lot of options for restaurants and here's the Asian Western and here is the Dolce Vita if you love Italian food, you must know this restaurant. Look at that. Very busy restaurant. And in front of the restaurant, you will see kind of like a souvenir shop. If you like to do shopping, you can go there as well. And here on the right side, this is the temple restaurant. Not really busy but okay there are some people there
And here on the left side, of course, this is the Baba Gum. Some people say it good, some people say it uh, quite expensive, but I don't know. But by this time, it's empty, eh? it's very quiet. Not really sure why. And here on the right side, they have the Club Havana. Quiet, but unfortunately. And here, the Dhamma restaurant, look at this. Very busy. Some people say Dhamma restaurant is very good. The Indonesian the taste or menu. And here, this is the bamboo bar and grill. Of course, they are busy. Look at this. A lot of tourists here. And here in front of us, this is the Spice Mantra, guys. For those of you that would like to see Spice Mantra, they are open, of course, and quite busy. Famous restaurant here. Anyway, you have a lot of options for Indian food along this street. You have Queens of India, and also Kailas Parbat, and many more. And here, this is the mall, the Discovery Mall. Some people ask me, where is the Matahari? Yeah, the Matahari right there. And you can go inside and you can shop at Matahari. But not a lot of product like it was before uh, in the Kuta Station, I mean Kuta Square. There is no live music tonight guys there. Or band. Normally they have it. Okay, so let's continue. Anyway, this is the situation in this area by 9 o'clock so if you stay along this street this is what you will get I think um, I like this area because it's not really crazy busy um, compared to Jalan Raya Pantai Kuta which is nearby the Beachwalk Mall what I don't like is it's always traffic there guys a lot of people like on and off I mean um, people like to go to um, Beachwalk Mall and then the car stop in front of the Beachwalk Mall. It caused a lot of traffic. Yeah, look at this. This is the Faith Hotel, I think. And they have the restaurant. And here is the Sun Island Hotel. But the restaurant is quiet at the moment. And here on the left side, all the shops are still open by this time. And here, as you can see, there are so many fake products. I mean, branded but fake, like Nike, Adidas, and many more. And here on the right side, look at that. So many tourists. They will go to the bar, maybe. They have bar there open. Green Garden Hotel still under renovation, still closed. And here, this is another Indian uh, restaurant, Indian Bollywood Masala. But next to it here is the Queens of India. So there are so many Indian restaurants along this street, guys. If you love Indian food, yeah, um, easy for you to go. That is the club, Grassy Kalis. And next to it here is the Anfaya. This is there on fire. This is where the situation is around. And this is the Fabris Hotel, of course. Quite famous hotel. Okay, so where is the Aiden Hotel? It's right here. On the left side. This is Aiden Hotel. Okay, so this is how it looks like at night. They have small cafe there at Aiden Hotel. And that is their lobby. And if you ask me how's the room, of course I don't know, I've never been there. And now it's very difficult to visit the hotel because most of the hotel they have their guests. So most of the time I got rejected. So, sorry. But anyway, let's continue. 
as you can see around in this area still busy which is good a lot of tourists walking around and here is on the right side Bintang Bali Resort and all the shops here are open and I would like to um, how to say it advise you guys when you change money uh, around here or around in Kuta or everywhere just go to the authorized money changer or if you have no option you can count your money in front of the counter before you leave if there is any something missing you can just tell directly the guy in the counter so they cannot uh, you will not lose your money at least okay so here is the Lipo mall by this time still busy which is good to see that a lot of people like to have their uh, dinner here because they can enjoy the dinner and also they can uh, enjoy the live music or the band right there is the stage so what do you think you like to come here as well in this area nothing much is happening there are some restaurants and here is the Indian restaurant again and here on the left side this is kind of like um, gallery or souvenir shops again and that is a new restaurant I think Norm Sushi Bar Kitchen that's uh, not busy at this time I don't know maybe uh, earlier they were busy hopefully here if you like to try horse taxi uh, you can try as you go straight there you will go to Jalan Wanasagara and also you can go to German Beach but of course by this time nothing to see at the beach anyway maybe the beach is closed and around here where you will find a lot of Indonesian food guys uh, here on the, on the left side for example they're selling uh, Indonesian food and here as well a lot of Indonesian food and here there is a crossroad if you go to the right you will go to the airport and if you go straight you will go to Jalan Tuban or Raya Tuban and if you go to the left you will go to Kubu Anyar next time I will go to Jalan Kubu Anyar maybe tomorrow or day after tomorrow just want to see what is happening there because uh, some tourists like to stay there as well Okay everyone, that's all for today's video from this area. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to support me by subscribing this channel. See you again in the next video. Thank you very much and bye now.